asking these persons to turn themselves in to the nearest police station. Um, these persons are O'Neill Reed, Tibal Clark, OCTJ, Devante Williams. to my view tv the people's platform the home of undiluted news reviews updates and your daily dose of entertainment don't forget to hit the notification bell leave us a comment like share and subscribe i don't bring nobody forward in your future for me everything where you see up my natural talent let me tell you something you see when you know what to please the audience wait it's simple me what going on with people? Open body you know, okay? Open body you know, right? Today you could be standing next to someone who's trying your best not to fall apart. So whatever you do today, do it with kindness in your heart. If our words are negative, we will reap negativity. If our words are positive, we will reap positivity. If our words agree with God, they will produce a godly outcome. Yes, people, I hope you all listen to that. Anyway, one time I believe in the justice system, them disappoint me. Me I be honest with you, no people. Look how me I tell the justice system that this boy is supposed to get bail. So the community fix him business for him. Them no give him no bail. Look who we are talking about now, people. A sentence hotel worker who is accused of raping his two underage cousins was denied bail when he appeared in the same catch in Home Circuit Court yesterday. The girls who are 15 and 12 were reported to be the sisters of the defendant's 17 year old girlfriend. Hold on the man people, you see a family business. The 24 year old is charged with two counts of rape, having sex with person under the age of 16 and grievous sexual assault. He was refused bail after the court was informed that he threatened the father of the alleged victim. The accused was ordered to return to court on September 13th. You see by that time, me am going to let him out. You understand? Give him bail, send him over next first. You have him name and everything, send him over next first. Who will know what we do with him? Cause he not supposed to see back in a no quarters. I go behind no cell. Me a be honest with you know. Orange are being made for the deportation of a Jamaican man who was held in Cayman. Hold on a bit you know. Cayman government. I'm begging you know one favor. Send him back in a one box. Send him back in a one box. We don't want him out here. No, 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 no. We can't afford to feed him. It can be honest with you know. People, you want one for one, one, one now. Arrangements are reportedly being made for Jamaican murder accused. Not no murder accused. Them boy, you are murderer. An alleged Spanish town gang leader, Randall Shaw, to be deported from Cayman to stand trial. Remember the paper that they said this about your kill a long, 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 long time. Shaw, who has been linked to the recent flare up of war in Spanish town, was arrested in Cayman on July 8th when the car he was traveling in rammed a police vehicle during a chase. If we don't send him back in our box, we we'll take him. You understand? Once him come back, dead, 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 dead. Jamaica, we accept him. We don't want him back out there alive. No, 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 no. Me time over on the news now, because you see them come and me tell them, say, criminal gets slapped away in a car. One will pop up in the comment section and say, no, my view, you're in family a ball. I go, go, you, you, you. Not no gosso. Not one thing gosso. I'm on a shed bus in St. James linked to the fatal shooting police said. The police has discovered that Wednesday evening, a large amount of ammo seized in Lilliput St. James is linked to the fatal shooting of a man on the Rose Hall Main Road in the parish hours earlier. Andre Young, yes people, Andre name, you understand, of Lilliput was killed just after 3 p.m. as he was driving along the main road. It was reported that Mr. Young has just left home when he was pounced upon and shot by his good old friends. You understand, him good, good, good friend, them come and slap him with. Him get to him deserve still. So, Superintendent Carlos Russell, commanding officer of St. James Police, told our news team that... In response to um, a murder that was committed, along the Rosal Lane Road. Yesterday, the police would have carried out a uh, target of the operation in the Bobman Hill area, that is really St. Benjamin, um, where they will target a premises um, and the approach of the police. Three men would have run um, into bushes at the rear of the premises. Police gave chase, however, they escaped. Search was conducted and two firearms a AR-15 rifle along with a 9mm pistol was found along with 93 5.56 cartridges 
as well as 12 linemen and um, cartridges. The fun what we are, we are picking up, um, there seems to be um, some conflict um, in the area, um, which is um, lottery scam related. We're asking these persons to turn themselves in to the nearest police station. Um, these persons are O'Neill Reed of Maldon District, Maroon Town, St. James, Tibal Clark, OCTJ, is of a Bobman Hill address, Lilliput, St. James, Devante Williams of Peel Street, Falmouth, Trelawney, and Russian Roshan Headley of Lilliput, St. James. Well, and then now, somebody needs to reach out to him, family member there for me. Let me ask them one question. I don't still feel like saying my gimmicks, man. I just want to ask me, my only come, come tell me, say, yo, a gimmicks, man, this them killing you know? them should have killed us, say, yo, tell. I don't still feel like saying, a gimmicks alone, they don't deal with. No, 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 no. Finally, we don't know where we know. This is a boy I mix up and him get to deserve. Word to the wise now, because I don't want to tell nobody say my view never help you not. You see, the people them who the call for some of the leftovers, them, the leftover for the last funeral, call them back right now and tell them, say, yeah, man, man, we can't go now again, because we have an extended February. Yes, so one of them things they can't use. Look, I'm over with the news, you have people writing a sentence, but began. And the big, stupid police, them, yes, the big, stupid police, them, down there. Do your business. After I go so boom, and I slap what she did that day. Oh, from God's earth. Who not rest them, my boy? Yeah. This does make sense. She was accused of carrying out an arm robbing St. Elizabeth last year has been captured by the police. An alleged gun and 15 rounds of ammo was allegedly taken from the suspect who are said to be from Clarendon. Superintendent Dwight Daly, head of St. Elizabeth Police, told our news team that the men were held shortly after they carried out an arm robbery in Mount St. Side at around 10 o'clock Wednesday night. Here we go, power go, and we have a big stupid police come, come talk to you. About 10 p.m. last night, Gunmen held up and robbed the patrons at a bar at Mountainside District in the parish of St. Elizabeth. They then made good their escape in a white Axio motor car. The police were alerted and they quickly responded. They spotted the car and intercepted it. In the car, they found three men, all of Clarendon addresses. The car was searched and a 9mm Taurus pistol loaded with 15 9mm cartridges were found. The men were arrested and the firearm seized. The items that were stolen were recovered. Right now, me I be honest with you, no people. You see, the family member for them are three criminal boy. Yeah? You see, this man in yeah? here, them should have put the court them together to say, yo, which part we can get the three part button in them? That them should have done. No, 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 no. Them should have looked to get liar. say, yo, look who's if you can't make them a boy and get bail. Because them run them and them taxpayers' money. Them boys should have get slapped. Boy. Who's on a bit there now, people? Fuss me, I hear this. Look like they'll write Chuck Japan lick him head. Yes, can finally attack something will make sense, people. Just this minute, stuff. Delroy Chop who drop and lick him head has charged the Human Rights Organization of Jamaica that has not been balanced in the right of victim and accused person. People, me are going to hear this soon, self, people. You understand? I never know a set them see where we see. As along and just want to talk about it. Here but you see, power, no. over the years or the decades in Jamaica, we have far too many wrongdoers, criminals, the corrupt, the indiscipline, the lawless, who regrettably have been emboldened to feel that they are above the law. And if they breach the law, they can always get various organizations to speak for them. We have to be very careful. And the very pinnacle that must be respected is the rule of law. And where people breach the law, and there's good evidence that they've breached the law, then wrongdoers must be brought to justice. Sure, they must get all the advice, all the representation that is needed so that they can have fair play, that they can have their day in court. But what has happened now is that the courts are so overwhelmed, so overburdened, that when people try to go to court to get justice now, it's almost an impossible task.